Hey there, Dr. Rob, the car doctor here with uh, the Honest Car Doctor. And today's goal with this video, real world behind the scenes on how I turn competitors into allies and how I've mastered that over the past eight years. So on that note, I'm going to tell you the truth about it. You're going to be usually busy. You're going to have to work on cars. Something's going to go on in your shop that you don't want to go out and do this uh you know, kissing babies and shaking hands type of things. But I promise you, if you do it, you're going to have more success, more freedom, more money, more fun. So prime example, I did this. I practiced what I preach. I did this last Friday. By the time it all came together, it was 3.30 on the Friday and I was rushed and I don't like to be rushed, but hey, I know the benefits of this. So I got um, got the the stuff together, some more tips here. One of the things we do is, uh, this is all Christy. Thank you, Christy, for having this gifts. Um, Ziploc, three limited edition 48 storage bags. They're really cool because they have the holiday feel to them. And then if you're worried about being a cheesy salesman about this kind of stuff, don't worry about that. You don't have to be. Simply take some cards to the bag and then make it about them. Because what I did was I got all this stuff together First thing I did was went to my body shop guy. He's kind of a little cranky and busy, but that's okay. You come in with some goodies and that'll make his day. And the cool part about it was this was my main goal to get in there to help him. But I also drove a customer's car that needed some uh, body work done. And I said, hey, Mark, um, main goal was to get this to you. But the second one was, hey, let's talk about this. And here's the cool part. He's three weeks out, but he's like, hey, I'll see what I can do, drop it off, and we'll go from there. So you get the best work out of them. They help you out. You help them out. It's a true win-win because I'm telling you, nobody else is doing this. And if you do it, you will be, this is how I got 20 shops to refer me business. And it's ethical. It's good stuff. So that was my first stop. And then my second shop was uh, the exhaust shop guy. Again, a really cool guy. Um, didn't have any need for business at the moment, but I wanted to touch base with them, uh, give them a couple bags of, uh, the checks mix. And then he's, he's really big into, uh, guns and things like that. And I'm a, a army trained sniper. So we talked about that a little bit and he goes, yeah, what are you up to? And that time I said, Hey man, got another shop. I'm doing coaching, consulting. And I also love OBD one vehicles. He goes, Oh man, you can have those. I don't want them. So gave him a couple cards you know, planted some seeds. Think about all this rep work you're doing. When you don't want to do it, you're planting a lot of seeds for the future. So that's a cool example there. And then parts guys as well too. I just stopped by real quick. And like I said, this is 3.30. I had about an hour and a half or so. It doesn't take long. It doesn't have to be difficult. Just, hey, got you some checks mix. I appreciate you guys helping me out with the parts and things like that. Now, uh, here's your checks mix. Now give me the right parts. And we laughed about that. So, um, that, that was real quick there. And then here, here's the coolest part. So the customer's car also has really ragged out, uh, carpet. And I was thinking, uh, cause I'm restoring it. I was thinking, oh man, I probably watch videos about painting carpet and I got to pull the seats out and do all this work. And, that type of thing, but I, I didn't even realize this. This is the other part. It was like, duh. I was talking to my detail guy, and I said, uh, you know, what do you guys think about painting these carpets? And he's like, oh, yeah, we do that all the time. And I'm like, really? And the cool part, and this is really the main key here, golden nugget. They're slow. This was Friday night. I could see the owner's worry on his face. If you're worried about your shop, if you have fears and doubts and things like that, action gets rid of that. So go, if you're, if you're slow and you're worried, go out and do these things. It'll come back. So gave him the checks mix, two bags of it. And I said, Hey, I'm here to help. Um, I'm going to be dropping off my, truck and here's the this is another real world truth from rob russell is that this is friday go the extra mile i, I got christie's help we got the truck down to them on a saturday 
and they're going to give me an estimate on today, you know, um, on what it's going to cost me to have them pull the carpets, paint it, do all that good stuff. So that's another bonus that I found out they can do it. So we solved these other problems. So they're going to refer me business as well. So that's really cool. So by working together, they need business. I have business. We solve problems together. So that's, that's how we do it. So, um, we're about five minutes or so. This one's just going to be real quick behind the scenes. That's how I did it. Just a recap here. I was rushed. It's not going to be the right time. I was working on a truck and I didn't want to do it, but I did it anyway. And I got really cool, uh, planting the seeds with a body shop guy. Uh, exhaust shop guy was really cool too. I, I need some exhaust work done too. And to all you shops that do exhaust work already, here's just a thought. If you can give them some business, your exhaust shops, they can send you a ton of business back. For example, with my local uh, exhaust shop, we could do it, but I give that business to them. So every time they have the check engine light, uh, misfire conditions, stuff they don't do that will damage the cat, who do you think they send the business to? You got it. So that's cool there. Um, Parts guys, detail shop, got some business back and forth. So um, in closing, remember, do the reps. It will make you stronger, but you just have to do them. Um, if you're afraid and don't know what to talk about in these meetings, just ask them questions. Hey, how can I help you? What can I help you with? Oh, you do carpets, things like that? Cool. You know, ask them questions and just listen. Um, and remember to have some fun, you know. If you have fears and doubts about doing this and you're not good with people or would rather work on a car, all that good stuff, I'm the same way. But I get over that, step through the fear, have fun with this, gets rid of the worries and doubts, and the business comes back. So that's it. Just wanted to shoot this quick video of a real world example of how I actually use my own systems to have fun and create business together. So that's it. Um, until next time, Dr. Rob, the car doctor, automotive consultant, trainer, uh, auto repair shop, A-level diagnostics guy, over and out. Take care.